just knowing that so many of them now understood their themselves like so many of them said that they just thought they were bad people and, and had never really seen it in the direction of it was the trauma that they received and you know since they were children well, you could just in the way that they were sharing you could feel and you could sense that they were um forgiving themselves that they were feeling um a love for themselves in those minutes in those hours in that particular exchange um and and again it's sometimes it's just those volunteers coming in saying i care to a person looking them in the eye and saying i care honestly sometimes it makes a big difference to people what i am most surprised and awed by was how much wisdom there was here about why it's so important for us to do early detection and early intervention and also beautiful and then also the compassion mixed with honestly ingenuity and just brilliance like honestly the um <laughs> i wrote them all down like every idea that came through them it was just like oh my gosh we we need you out here we need you to um you know we need these ideas to uh transform reform school one of the things that they had brought up was to be able to help the youth through now we have zoom and even though they can't get out they can work with the parents to teach them how to deal with some of these issues that they actually felt when they were a kid so i mean it it's just amazing and also how much hope that i experienced today from the the prison residents who were going through the compassion prison project and learning about their own aces and how they can be part of healing for themselves for the prison community and for their larger communities back home you could you could tell that our like unconditional motherly love there was just giving him something maybe he you know hadn't had and i did hear a lot of those stories that they never felt that safe love i mean it it's just amazing especially when people are all working together you know the communities and the volunteers and the the staff at the at the prison um you know and the participants in the program it's just I think that's what we need to change the world because right now they they know what we need right because it's it's a it's a human need right it's a human need it's a humanity need so yeah the compassion that i felt both that they had for themselves the people in their lives the people that they may have hurt and it is beautiful isn't it like compassion does breed ingenuity compassion does is creative compassion is all the things that we saw and that i you know heard from the gentleman that day so um this is like an icu for aces <laughs> right and everybody knows that the work that happens in the icu the reason they call it the icu is because it's the intensive care unit and this is the place where intensive care needs to be happening and that is the work that the compassion prison project is doing you're my hero my dear